5.51 a.m., 40 degrees. Flea market season is starting. All righty, gotta get the flashlight out. Flashlight brigade. Um, I did see a trailer over here. I don't know if it's a tote man's though. Don't wanna get run over. Everyone's setting up. People are excited. New season. Oh, maybe that is a tote man. New season starting. Uh, it's gotta be. Tote man's in a different spot because they took the tote man spot. It's like that song, you don't mess around with Jim. You don't take the tote man spot. These are all DVDs and CDs. Oh, wow. George Harrison. Oh, Revolver. Dirty Dancing. The best of the stylists. The Beatles. These are pretty good. Willie Nelson. Nice. Touch. And some books. Dogs. Mold. Plates. Norman Rockwell. Pockets. Hmm. Those books. More trains, 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 trains. How's your winter? Good morning. All right, Bobby. Start charging in Going to Georgia as soon as they find time to buy a new one. Right, I don't know. Oh man, this size with the higher room. Just watch this. What's up? Your buddy's having an auction. Oh man, it's here. At the same place? Oh yeah, yeah. Where am I going with this? Oh, Luca. My name is Luca. I live on the second floor. This stuff's wet. Oh, there's a little snowman. He's cute. Huh? That's Santa. Put that out. Some little one. That guy. I don't need it though. You're a good boy, so. You have a nice winter. Not bad. How about you? You got so big. What a good boy. Here, good boy. Oh, yeah. Okay. Get back to shop. Oh, boy. We're laughing out here, man. <laughs> We're not. We've, it's been too long. <laughs> it's been too long. in that one. It's going to have to get in there. Ugh. Cocktail things. Those are cute. Those are eggs. Yep, they're eggs. Oh, they're um, ceramic. That's oh, Snoopy. What's this one? Oh, boy. <laughs> These are Christmas presents. <laughs> Christmas present for all you ladies. Stones. All sorts of things. Set tapes. Club days. The 2000s. Everyone loves some club days. Which are so cool. Yeah. You guys can Oh, gosh. Yeah. Got a lot of them. Oh, my gosh. This is the time life. If these are all in here, these actually sell. I spend my time patting the cup. Oh! That's like the vintage Easter stuffed animals. Oh. Now, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> I 
Bob's gonna be like, hey. <laughs> I'm pretty sure the tote man's gone through this though. Pretty sure. Pretty sure. Okay, everyone just, just, just dig, dig it out. Grab it from my hand. Why not? Cast iron Kev is even here. Let's see what he can find. Yes, saw a little kid. Hello, Uncle Dick. We'll send you a card. Mm -hmm. then, oh, we got some other things in here. That's a cool, that's actually a very cool ashtray. Look at that. Yeah, Cast Iron Kev is here. If you like Cast Iron, how about Restore Cast Iron? Go check him out. Oh, we got a whole bunch of. This might be the oldest stuff today. Aw. We'll rescue him. That's a reproduction photograph. Well, a reprint of an old photograph. Weddings. Farm on I think that's empty. No, it's not. I'm gonna try and get stuff in the bottom. Get some prints, it looks like. Just don't wanna make a mess. Oh, that's cute. A Charlie Brown mug. Oh, um, American Horror Story. I like the uh, coven one uh, about the Louisiana witches. Interesting show, that's for sure. Ooh, lotion. Mountain mist. Yeah, corner wall shells, fly traps. What is this crafting? Oh, there's a cutter. I'm not trying to get my bag to not be in the way of anyone. Get some crystals. Ooh, dazzle your own shoes. These are always great. Oh, uh, can I use this one? Oh, that one's really fancy. Huh. I have one of those things. Cards. All sorts of stuff for scrapbooking. Stamps in here. More embellishments. Michael's metal trinkets. Metal trinkets. <laughs> Underneath, they got some rabbits. We got a whittled man. Harmonica? Oh. Oh, this is like what I got on one of my necklaces. In that gold um, jewelry box, there were hands like this. box has all sorts of little things. Small house in gold wood frame. <laughs> They're descriptive. Let's see. Gotta open it. Let's see what we're working with. Apparently people are already haggling with the tote man. It's the first day of the season for him. Give the man what he wants. Bottle. Oh man, what do you want? Finished up at the tow man. It's like old times. Being back. <laughs> I got a few things. Always fun to see what he has. See what other people find amongst the totes. And just, it's just good to be back digging in the tow man's totes and seeing what treasures he has brought. I'm excited for this flea market season, but let's get back out there and see what else we can find. Got a lot of 
recipes today. Just a little pile from today. The first day, not crazy finds, but it was still fun to be back and dig through the totes and see what everyone had to offer. So the best thing in terms of money, potential money in reselling out of the pile would be this Dream Paro Tarot card set. Now they have out of print $59.95. That's what they were asking at the time. I have no idea if all the cards are in there. The book is in there. You can see the box is a little beat up but uh, vintage, retro, older tarot cards do sell. People love the artwork. People that do tarot card reading, if they like a certain set, um, they might wanna to add to their set. So this could be the, the best things in term, the best item in terms of reselling. We also have a body and soul collection. This is from Time Life. Oh, I forgot, we got those guys in there too. This is from Time Life. Um, these are unopened CDs, so you just have all sorts of songs. Jeffrey Osborne, Boys to Men, Barry White, etc. Uh, the Time Life Collection, this one does sell online, and um, I'll just have to see how many CDs are in here. If it's the complete 10 CD set, then that should be good for selling too. We did find some photos, of course. We have the Railroad these which look uh, i think they are similar look at the mom's hair and there is some writing on the back so we'll have to look at that we got this elephant from a zoo tampa lowry park zoo i do love the vintage elephants this cute little wooden i'm gonna that's not an emblem but i thought perhaps this would be nice for the cover of a junk journal something nature themed i like the look of it we got an ashtray. No idea. The color, pretty color. This is, I think it's called a F-I-G-A, a fig, figa, figa hand. And sometimes they say this could be for fertility. One person has it listed as like a middle finger thing. <laughs> it's not. Uh, the one storage unit that I bought actually had these on a necklace but they were made of different stones so that's how I recognize that and then perhaps the, the the fun thing that I found today was this little box of recipes and they are all I believe printed or written out we have the magic cookie bars I think these aren't too old they're probably from the 80s or 90s fudge polka dot dotted chocolate polka dotted chocolate fudge Ooh, rugelash oh my gosh Ooh, that one's gonna stay with me peanut butter marbled brownies this one's very good tea time tasties from a newspaper so they wrote where or they typed where they got their recipes from this is a cream cheese cookies from bisquick now if these were handwritten from you know like the 40s or earlier then the value of them reselling wise would be a little bit higher people absolutely love the vintage recipes but these are still nice rhubarb berry crumble so we got a whole little box of vintage recipes and just like that another flea market season has begun got out there saw many of the regulars that we see every year whether they are 
buyers or sellers. Of course, the tote man was there with his totes. People were ready to buy, look, rummage around, see what they can find. Jimmy was there with his dog, Blue. Blue had a good winter. Blue's back out, ready to sniff out the treasure, see what stuffed animals he can take home. <laughs> Taco Stacks was there and just a a whole bunch of people cast iron kev was there uh, tina from gemini thrifts was there so everyone was out and about ready to get out start the flea market season off on the right foot and see what they can buy i found a few treasures for myself nothing you know no million dollar rare find but some items that can be resold make a profit and other things like i did end up buying some conditioner for my hair two for five can't get those prices at Walmart. So that was a good find for me as well. Not breaking the bank, saving some bucks, and just going on another treasure hunt for the flea market season. So I hope that you will join me in this upcoming spring and summer and fall. Lots of flea markets, lots of digging around, and hopefully lots of great vintage and antique things to find. So thanks for much. I hope you enjoyed this flea market adventure. If you did, Click on that thumbs up button and I have plenty of other flea market videos for you to enjoy as well. Thanks so much for watching and I will see you all for the next adventure here at Paper and Moose. Mm -hmm.